Welcome, in front of me is a Redmi 13 and today I will show you how you can record a screen on this phone. So to get started, pull down your toggles by swiping down from the top of your screen and then swipe down once again. And this will reveal obviously a bunch of toggles with their names. Now on one of the pages you will find a screen recording. Now for me it's on the first page. Once you see yours you can simply tap on it. It brings up this overlay right here with a couple options like record, folder which takes you to the screen recordings, the settings and the close. Now you can go into the settings and customize that if you want to. But I'm just going to jump straight into recording. Once you're done, you can interact with this overlay and click on the red square, which will stop and save your screen recording. Now, there is a reason why I actually spend a little bit more time on the Netflix application for this showcase, and you will see that in a second once you, uh, in your case, open up your Photos application so you can find your screen recording. Now, it will be located in the library and camera by the looks of it. Yep, there we go. So from here, you can uh, view your recording. Um, Typically, most applications will be recorded, but there are some exceptions, like the Netflix application, uh, which utilizes a Android feature that is designed for privacy and security of the user. Um, but obviously, this application doesn't give a shit about that, and it does it for its own um, nefarious uh, reasons. So this is done, I presume, to prevent piracy, but let's be honest, no one is pirating Netflix content by recording it, so uh, this is just kind of like a middle finger. And this is the Netflix being open right now. Uh, you've seen the keyboard for a moment, so that was the login page. Uh, but for all you could see throughout the recording was a straight up black screen. Keep in mind, I have not agreed to any terms of service, of use of the application, nor have I logged in uh, to this garbage. And yet it still can uh, do this kind of thing. And I'm pointing that out in this kind of way because there is no setting for you to turn off and disable this feature. If you encounter an application that blocks your screen recorder, that's it. You have nothing to change. You cannot record this application no matter what you do. Uh, which I find to be an absolute bullshit considering it's your phone and yet you don't have control over what you can record on your own phone because some garbage application decided that nah, you're not gonna record this. It's supposed to be your phone, not Netflix's phone. And keep in mind this application comes pre-installed with the device, so that's even bigger middle, middle finger. Um, now, anyway, with that being said, um, most of the other applications, uh, or of applications in general, should be recordable. And primarily this kind of feature that I described is used by bank applications, and you can kind of imagine how this would be beneficial to you uh, in terms of security and bank applications. Now when it doesn't really matter is in Netflix, Hulu's, and all that other garbage websites uh, that utilize this for no reason. So anyway, with that being said, hopefully you found this video helpful and informative, and if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.